Bobel my song. Why me take it? I'm not them. Make by one in Bray. Victor to Lunto Briggs or Bed Day. So why me take it? I'm not them. Are you going to pray? Yeah, why I go go? Why did you do our remove? Bra corner my ye. So I don't boss or tell me why pick my booty. I'm a me be my bra. It's something I have never experienced before. Um, I love what uh, the whole thing that happened here today because it's not even man made, it's divine grace of God. Oh my God, I wish him a further elevation so that he will have that opportunity to help the poor masses. I'm a bius, my brother, I want a tour. Tuluto, I want a tour. Kala Sakura Bu. I want a nagri, gri, 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 kala tour. One in me, I'm in by the back of my boat. I'm no, Nimi Copra, Kimmy Smith, Boma Copra. So when you bought a cake or a gap me, you keep Boma, or Bobo brought a one in gap me, me a lime, Boma Smith, a cake, I'm not pre. I'm not even expecting any gift today. I was just called as my classmates. I should come and celebrate his birthday, 40th birthday with him. I was so surprised I was one of the beneficiaries. Cash. I beg. He had your name. Come out. We know that time. Make rain. No come meet us here. Kate. Mama Labi. Now cash. Kate. Mama Labi. Is that a My friend and uh, a colleague. And an associate in, in business, basically. I want to say that it's a beautiful thing. It's been a while since I came out in solidarity with anyone on certain celebrations because in a long while now, we've all tried to keep our distance because of coronavirus. But because of Victor Brick, Tilto Briggs, you can't say you wouldn't because number one, this man has touched different lives and has been there for anyone who cares to know or who is part of him or his friend or family. I want to use this opportunity to say thank God for protecting this my young friend, for making him know that there is God and also for pushing him forward to gather people from all walks of life. A lot has been said about Victor. And most of them, true. Uh, something striking in his character is that if he says that something is good, he will fight for it to the end. Now for church we meet, so he's a lover of God. He's a businessman, he's many things in one. But above all of that, he's a good man. He is my brother. So I beg, beg that they pray for him. And I want to thank the teachers who flogged him and flogged that good into him. Now so it be today don't be for long talk. So my friend and brother Victor Briggs, it's good to celebrate person with that life. And we celebrate you because you're a good man. Congratulations. I want to say that Victor is a gift from Abonima to the world. Yes, um, it's a thing of joy. You know, when you want to talk about a good person, you don't struggle because you won't have to lie. You will say it exactly as it is. Um, it's one person you can talk about and you will not be considered a psych because there's nothing you will say that it will not be what it is. He's kind, he's forgiving, he's friendly, he's compassionate, he's interested in other people's development and progress. And that is why you see he maintains friendship across across ethnicity, across age, across interests, across religion. All shits and uh, people of different spheres are his friends. And these are just few of his friends. A lot of them are in Lagos, Abuja, different parts of They are connected in regards of this birthday. As we speak, there are other occasions connected to this birthday that is still ongoing, that will be ongoing after now. Um, we want to thank you for the role you played. We will not take much of your time. Um, some other person may have something to say, but on a final note, I just want to say a big thank you to the community of Bonima, to the ethnicity, the joy ethnicity and the Calabari people. 
I want to say that continue to give him the needed cooperation. Just to say thank you, and from what we have got, just to see that people, to, I want to see people are doing something, and, it's, and it was also encouraging, but this is not what for the part that I've seen, and this is where I started from, I will not leave my life in this place. I will put that part of my, uh, part of my uh, plan, and then we will see that every time we do something with this it's not a big money, it's not a big money, we are doing this thing for us. So if you see, tell me about you, and I tell you, it's not a big thing, it's not a big thing, but I want to thank you for all your support, thank my friends, my family, my mother, my younger ones, everybody, all their advice and their assistance for me to get where I am today. You know, I told my lovely wife and my children, and I, because I know the role she has to play in my life. Nobody has judged us before, since we got married, this is about 13 years. Now, nobody has judged us all. I think my wife is my house. I think we are working to live together. Thank you, and God will bless you. Celebration, man. We give thanks to God Almighty. Okay, one of Okibo, Obe, the Bagalama, my special and family now. Pige ingi, yo pingo, yam napo. Okay, one of the Bo me the Bagalama. Why me take it? Obe lama. Just just me take Obe then. One of the gigi me Pige. Erim that wa so far, what to say ya? Obra swa bran ni biyano. Obra swa. One protect ni biyano. One protect ya. Everything we take here in the family now, you have not put now in Guinea, you have not put now in April. You go on a family now, so I'll be more, I'll be more like they make care of the lama. I won't be able to hear now. It's Anna and the other people. Then I go to my mummy is to. I'm a maybe a mutual mood in April. In care brass, what take care in Guinea. You bring government, but I can't get the gold up and get the gold up. And I think that contributes to care. We have all the boss are able to boss over. I'm a baby, I'm in me taking a bit. I go to my mummy. Ghana, ah, do I pack a bag? Man, I'm a school, primary school man. Ghana, I'm a very secondary school man. Ghana, I'm not tipping a bag. Ghana, I'm not going to be a careless man. Ghana, when I'm with him, I'm taking a bit. I'm not going to fake bull. I'm not going to be a bull bull man. So I go to my is to brass water. Can my career up? One of my gear up. One of my gear up. Just in the day, me yeah. Brass water in April. I'm not going to go to fridge now. Generator now. Sewing machine now. Because if we can April, can petty business be it so that they can be able to help their family. Victor has been the, a brother in the church, a childhood friend, and a very close friend indeed, yes. That has been his manner. The Honorable Briggs is a generous man, he's a philanthropist. His nature is to give. Victor has been known from childhood to be a giver. And so that is his nature. Anytime to, tomorrow, he will keep giving. It's his nature, and we appreciate him for that. Um, it's a good thing to do good. Um, he didn't just start now. He has always been doing this kind of thing, doing good to people. So I believe that what he has done now will go a long way in helping the less the privileged. First, I'd like to say happy birthday to Victor Tulutu Briggs. I want to wish him uh, everything he has in mind and all the things that God also has in mind for him. I want to wish him long life. I want to wish him prosperity. I was want to wish him more success in his endeavor. I want to wish him um, happiness in life. I want to wish him achievement in, in all his plans, all he intends to do to become and achieve in life. So those are my wishes for him. Hallelujah. 
Mr. Briggs is a very, very good friend of mine. I've been, I've been friends with him for about uh, 20, 21 years now. And uh, I can tell you for sure that he's a very nice guy. And um, he has been helpful to me even in my younger days when we met. In fact, I could tell you for free that he's responsible for my being the person that I am today. And for that, I am, I am, I am, I'm proud of him. And I'm grateful for, to God for such a friend. Victor Briggs. Victor Briggs is a philanthropist. We all know that. And he has touched lives in so many ways. He has impacted and people um, Port Harcourt and Diaspora. So no doubt he's a good man. Um, I just have to say he should keep the good work going. God will bless him and enlarge his coast in Jesus' name. Amen. We're wishing him a happy birthday. A day filled with joy, happiness. We wish him all the best. We wish him long life, prosperity, in good health, and many more achievements in life. Victor Briggs is my boss. He's my MD. Um, Big Briggs Nigeria Limited. We've uh, I've known Victor for over. Uh, over 20 years. There is half, half of his years on earth have known Victor. He has been a very good friend. He has been a good boss. Uh, he's my younger brother, but I take him as a boss. And uh, he has been very, very close to me and my family. In fact, his, uh, his immediate family take me as one of their their brothers. Dr. Briggs has been a <clears throat> philanthropic uh, person. He likes giving out. Even when he does not have, he likes giving out. So it is his nature. Uh, I'm not surprised. You know, it has been his nature. And he, uh, um, for doing it on his 40th birthday is uh, a plus to what he has been doing before. You are a young man that has made people proud. And we cannot stop. We cannot see I'll watch Jutos doing these things every day. It is our own responsibility as Jutans to support those who are promoting rebalances as it is. And this day, all we have of the Jutos will be 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 the Uh, congratulations, K. Victor Tuluntu Briggs, bro. I said, okay, uh, Tuluntu Briggs, oh, we embrace you, Kiao, because it's sweet out. Uh, or better, me, one of you, Bella Malama, Mary, as a person, or a picky age mate. But on months came in and you're right. So I'll be a happy birthday, Kobe. One of 40th birthday has been so unique. 40 years, and the results, within these 40 years, 
is outstanding. Uh, Bring it up, Brad. That why he yes, I keep it brass. Uh, yeah, one I'm not preparing. One minute, Brad, go One make a bucro mine. One pick here, my one make a bucro mine. Easier, a politically big game, make a bucro mine. Easier, one more con more correct about it. And Brad, go go one make a bucro mine. Easier, a politically big game, make a bucro mine. And Brad, go go one make a bucro mine. Easier, a politically big game, make a bucro mine. The younger people. I already tell you around there, maybe yes, I go go a bit belly, it may be me. That way, crop also, I'm not picking brass or one boy chap of pretty, I'm picking. We are Brahma do got a year. So happy birthday and many more years ahead. I'm going to be there, or do that a brabona, or Corral in a mind view, and oh, or Dina Gore. I go to the Gare Yana on the Japonia, my dear, be Saram. There is a dinner. One hour, man, empowerment goes in Nina Kinapri about two or two. A man, Saki Bobo, a youth distinguished youth, a member so crab you. No, a foundation, Yanate, the Brassois, the Grandpona, Yanapona, and Apona Prairie. I have known Victor Tulutu Breeze for quite a while. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I've known him for the past 20 years, closely, not him closely. Uh, this is a young man that, uh, for me, is an example for every young man in River State or in Nigeria to emulate. Uh, uh, I know him far when he was uh, involved in youth activism in River State, how he led the River Youth Movement to his family and to the present state we are relating with him. The word may not be enough to describe Victor, that is the fact, because uh, if I should be given time to talk about Victor, we will not uh, live here. That is the extent I've known that young man. The truth remains that looking at his uh, background, he may, not, he may not have come from a very rich background, uh, but today he's one young man that uh, uh, you can reckon with. You can reckon with in every sphere. You can reckon with. My name is Comrade Elvis Liburaikoma. I'm an Ogoni man. Uh, by the grace of God, I've been in leadership of um, Apex leadership bodies in Ogoni. Um, but I, I started by you know, uh, working with Victor Briggs as the Secretary General of River State Youth Organization many years back, precisely close to two decades today. And that's to tell you how long we've known ourselves. As um, a vibrant young man, I must say, um, they used to say that um, uh, life begins at 40. Some say a fool at 40 is a fool forever. But I can tell you that Victor has been long, long, way long wiser before 40. And that's to tell you that he is... Um, one of the few who um, are endowed with the innate you know, qualities that have helped him in life to attain the status he has attained even before 40. Good morning, Mr. Richard Obunaya. Good morning. Um, I must be very frank with you. Over the time, I have come to know you through Honorable Dr. Victor Bush. I have seen you as one man that stands for the justice, stands for the truth, no matter how bitter it may. Please, can you tell us how you come to have an encounter with Honorable Dr. Victor Briggs? I met Victor Briggs uh, in church. Uh, God's Heritage Ministries International, D-Line Portacot, with his family. And uh, from then, we became friends from friendship. We have uh, become brothers. Okay, sir, can you as well briefly tell us this young man who eventually became friend to your brother, how vibrant he is in terms of his business career. Can you tell us a little about him? 
Victor is a very unique person. Uh, I, I like to think of him as an institution. He's many things on the move, on one go. A father, businessman, philanthropist, politician, all in one package. What stands him out is passion for humanity. Uh, it didn't take me long to bond with him because I saw the fortress in him. A fortress person is someone who doesn't, uh, who stands uh, firm, positively, in all endeavors. A fortress man is a man who is consistent in his ways. My name is Godwill, Alasso Prince Will. A manager, government through community relations, and the BRICS Nigeria Limited. My boss, Honorable Dr. Victor Briggs, is a man of many parts. As a person, I met Honorable Dr. Victor Briggs while I was in school. It was an occasion where I was in a serious issue and I was led to him. Honorable Dr. Victor Briggs stood for me and give the best he could. Dr. Victor Briggs is a philanthropist in high dimension. From the time I have known him to date, it has been his style, his calling, empowerment, is what he does to keep his life more happier. What we went to do in Abonima is just as usual. To some, it might be so much of how, but to we that are close, we knew that there is no day Victor Briggs does not reach out to people. Making it eventful is just to create the atmosphere for people to know how much he cares. His bread is given. He loves it as he loves himself. At some point, we could also say, hope oh, at the AMD, you will not someday give us out as a gift. Because no matter what is involved, he did not hesitate to share and he doesn't have any remorse, regret for how much he sent out to the rich out of the needy. That was what displayed in Abonima. Fridges, generator sets, sewing machines, cash donations, mission them was given to the needy, to his friends and the elderly just to ensure that they had a feeling about his gesture. 